Santa's Hawaiian Holiday by Malia Collins. North Pole Times breaking news, December 1st. North Pole breaking news, Santa reported missing. Last night, suddenly bright lights were seen flying across the sky. Reindeer were missing from their stalls and a workshop full of confused elves was in a sudden panic. When asked of Santa's whereabouts, a seemingly calm Mrs. Claus replied, No comment. I was tired, I was beat, I needed a rest. Even Mrs. Claus said, Nick, you're not looking your best. Such a cold, snowy place, that's my home, the North Pole. So I scoured the newspaper, thinking where I might go. Paris, eh, I'd been there. And Cairo, and Bali. I'd flown over Boise, Hong Kong, and New Delhi. I imagined the globe. Spin it. Where would I pick? I stopped in my tracks. And then, it all clicked. I've got it, I hollered. Let's load up the sleigh. All I need, I'll need my red swimsuit and slippers away. Also some sunscreen and snacks for the ride. A beach book, my swim fins, and a traveler's guide. I'm off to Hawaii, the islands in the sea. For the next few days, I'll kick back and just be. We flew through the night, all my rangers and I, blazing past stars till something below caught my eye. There in the ocean, an incredible scene. Hawaii lay floating, unreal as a dream. No time to dawdle, I called to my herd. Half an hour till sunrise, fly swift as a bird. The reindeer bore down and we made it post haste to the shores of Sunset Beach without a moment to waste. Honolulu news, big waves, December 5th. Haleiwa, big waves and monster swells brought out more than just beachgoers and surfers at Pipeline today. Sightings of a white-haired man in a red suit were too numerous to count. Could it possibly be Santa Claus is here in Hawaii right now? We ran to the water and splashed into the blue, saw seaweed and coral and fish by the sloop. I floated at peace in the water so clear and said to the wave, I think I belong here. I swam and I snorkeled. I hiked up Diamond Head. I ate plate lunch and shave ice with snow cap. I said, learning how to hula and hang loose like a pro. I baked in the sun saying, where I'm from, there's snow. Honolulu News, December 10th, Waikiki. It had been reported that a big room and an outdoor lanai suit for, suite for eight has been reserved at the Royal under the name S. Claus. Hoof marks have appeared in the sand and the sounds of Christmas bells are in the air. Is it true that Santa has been spotted on a surfboard? More details to come. The North Pole. Oh, it lingered and stuck in my mind. And the longer I stayed, the bigger the bind. Mrs. Claus called and asked, when will you fly home? I heard nothing but surf and then put down the phone. I was happy and tanned and relaxed as could be. I was home, wasn't I? on this island in the sea. Honolulu News, December 15th, Eva Beach. A ruckus broke out in aisle two at Long's this morning when a tanned white-haired man, looking very much like Santa Claus, bought up the remaining stock of chocolate-covered macadamia nuts. Saloon pilot crackers, rubber slippers, and Lee Hing mango saying, this is too good not to share with the rest of the world. Minutes later, he was spotted in the line at Zippies buying zip packs for nine. See ruckus, A8. We caught the Route 52 bus and circled the aisle, past Eva Beach and Wahiawa. It took us a while. We drove up to Haleiwa, saw surfers galore, and watched the winter swells crash up and down the North Shore. At Kualoa Ranch, we rode horses. We netted fish in Kahulu'u. The plumeria smelled sweet as rain. There was so much to do. The days passed too quickly, and the countdown began. Just 10 days till Christmas, I needed to plan. The North Pole was calling for help in my shop, but I was having fun in the sun. I didn't want to see another snowdrop. December 20th, Honolulu, Hawaii. This is just in, only days before Christmas, and all the letters addressed to S. Cloud, North Pole, are being stamped, returned to sender. There's no sign of Santa, at least at the North Pole, but here in Hawaii, it seems that there are many Santa sightings taking us to Kailua Beach, where Santa reportedly spent the day paddling canoe. If you are reading this Santa, although we'd love for you to stay, the North Pole needs you. Dear Santa, we think, oh, a mysterious letter arrived in the mail. It read Santa Claus General Delivery Royal Hawaiian Hotel. Dear Santa, we think it was you we saw swimming in the waves at Kailua Beach Park. It's one of our faves. But we have a few questions. We're a little concerned. 
Christmas is coming. Isn't it time to return? We know it might be hard to believe us, we know. And although you can't see yourself back in the snow, remember, you can take Hawaii with you, if only in your heart. And why not teach the world about Hawaii? Well, show you how to start. Meet us tomorrow. We'll help you get ready. There's lots to do. So we'll move fast and steady. Love, Mihana, and Kamuela. In Kailua town, we met my new friends and I. Time was growing short. Good thing we could fly. We gathered seashells at Sandy's and beach glass at Tong's. But lay in Chinatown in beach buckets from Long's. We grabbed turtles and dolphins from Ala Moana Mall. Ukulele and Palaka shirts, large, medium, and small. I memorized the sweet sounds of the slap key guitar. In my Aloha shirt, my friends giggled, so local you are. We filled the big sleigh till we thought it would burst, but before we went home, we made special stops first. We flew Mehana and Kamuela to their holly by the sea, and as we waved our goodbyes, they made me to spleet. Don't forget us, they yelled, as the reindeer took flight. With Hawaii in your heart, wherever you go, it will be like you're back here in the islands we know. We made one last stop to the shores of Sunset Beach, where I first touched the land. I rested my sleigh and opened my hand. I scooped up some sand, tucked it into my pouch, gave the deer a great whistle, and th for this I will vouch. We took off in the air, and that sand made us lighter. It lit up the sky, made the stars even brighter. We made it home before Christmas and Mrs. Claus jumped for joy. We knew you would make it, you jolly old boy. In our sleigh full of gifts, we flew into the night, riding fast on the glow of the moon's winter light. So this year, good children, don't be surprised when you open your gifts and there on them lies a layer of sand or a necklace of shells or a conch that is roaring like big winter swells. They are gifts from the islands I'm sharing with you, a little aloha and the promise of more. Christmas day spent on a sandy seashore. December 25th, Honolulu News. December 25th, Honolulu, Hawaii. It appears that children around the world have been waking up to something special. Blue skies and stockings filled with seashells and candy. There has been the smell of sunshine and for a few minutes this morning, the whole world felt like it was waking up in Hawaii.